So on February 6th of 2016, your girl Beyonce just dropped her latest music video, Formation. And it's already causing a load of controversy and new headlines in general. Everybody's talking about it, you know? She made references to the Illuminati, I mean, at the beginning of the song. You know, her daughter with Jay-Z, Blue Ivy, made a very special guest appearance. And now she's being accused of stealing clips from a documentary for the music video. Now, I'm going to read to you what two of the guys behind the documentary called The Beat, Mr. Chris Black and Abteen Bedgerer. I hope I'm pronouncing his name correctly. But before I get into that, I just want to say this. Beyonce's music video for Formation, as well as the documentary The Beat, is posted on my blog if you want to see them. It's only a little over nine minutes long, so, you know, it's not a really long thing. It's not two hours or something like that. So if you want to see it for yourself or if you want to see Beyonce's latest music video, click the link below. Visit my blog if you need a link because you can't find it in the description box. Let me know in the comment section. I'll hook you up. No problem. But I'm going to read to you what these guys had to say about on social media so you can come to your own conclusion on this whether or not you think Beyonce actually stole something or if people kind of jumped the gun here. Chris Black is up first. He said in a quote, new Beyonce video used hella clips from the doc I produced and directed by at Abteen. Why? Then he posted a link to the actual documentary. I guess it's flattering that people fuck with the things you created, but also frustrating when they want to use it like it's theirs. Why Melina got to use clips from our doc? Was the budget not big enough to spend a week in New Orleans and actually build with the people? The funny thing is that our doc is low-key iconic, so the audacity to rip and pass it off like, we not gonna notice, you out of touch, B. At least credit the filmmakers that followed their passion and did the actual work. Also, rest in peace, Nikki the B. That's one of the people that were in the documentary that unfortunately passed away. If you're an artist, Always protect your work. They don't know what you had to sacrifice to create. Laughs out loud, your $500,000 budget wasn't enough to make your video whole. Now let's see what Abteen had to say about it. This was a repost of Chris Black's message. Abteen said, and I quote, I'm not mad. It's the sad reality of the music business. Doesn't affect my friends and my work, but not cool. Here's a link to the beat. Enjoy. He posted a link to it. Shout out to at Isaac Bauman, our cinematographer on the project, three kids in the camera, at the black, which is Chris Black's Twitter handle. Rest in peace, Nikki the B, hashtag that B. Thanks for the credit at Melina Matt Sulkis and at Beyonce. So at the end they ended up crediting these people. But at first it caused, you know, a huge stink. And it's crazy because why was Chris Black not notified about, you know, them being credited in the first place if he was a part of the documentary that they used some of the footage of? It's just very odd. The whole thing is very odd, but it's called That Beat. And I don't know what the acronym B-E-A-T stands for, but it's in capital letters with little periods in between the letters. So I assume that each letter stands for a different word. But here's the deal. This is a completely unrelated note, and I posted this video on my blog as well if you want to see it. Abteen Bajarer directed Peso for ASAP Rocky. The same guy behind that beat. So yeah, Formation, that beat, and Peso are all posted on my blog. You can click the link below in the description box if you need a link to it. Let me know in the comment section. I will hook you up. Let me know what you think about it all below. Be sure to subscribe to the Meat Magazine YouTube channels. Visit meatmagazine.blogspot.com. Follow me on Twitter at Meat Magazine. Did Beyonce steal from these guys or did she do things the fair square way? Let me know below. <gasps> Meat Magazine.